It's we continue to look tonight at the prevalence of guns on our streets. Yesterday, we told you that guns are being smuggled into the country through private vessels. And tonight, Janae Noel Ferguson looks at how crafty criminals are now shipping parts here to make guns of their own. Police are becoming increasingly concerned about components for guns being imported into the country. An agent clearing a container is finding some stuff purchased from Amazon loaded in the container that he is checking and he recognizes its component parts for firearms and so we have to pay attention to that. Officer in charge of the firearms unit Ken Strawn says if allowed to go unchecked criminals are able to bring these parts in to assemble their own high-powered weapons. He showed examples of pens and PowerPoint pointers that are now being used in gun making. That not everyone understand what these parts are. The unscrupulous person knows what it is and using legitimate means to bring other stuff in and using the opportunity to also bring in those parts. Custom, the Bahamas Customs Department right now is running a series of retrainers for its staff and we are intimately involved with that process in trying to assist the officers in identifying some of what we have found as these various component parts. ASP reservist Hang Bain, who is considered an expert on firearms, said some of those devices were common in the past, but are now making a comeback. This pen gun, this has been around for some time. During my time, this has been around, mm -hmm. but there has been an increase. Mm -hmm. The pen gun was one of the weapon that was very common among the drug dealers. Meanwhile, Sean says that at the end of the day, the goal is getting those weapons off of the street and getting the public to understand the far-reaching impact of one weapon. This weapon here, this is a six-shooter. So in the first instance, until we reload this, that's six potential lives lost. This magazine has a capacity of 17 loaded in this, and surely there's the potential of 17 single lives lost. Um, the assault rifle, we load a, mic, a clip inside there, which can, we can put a clip that can hold as many as 45 rounds of ammunition. There are new clips that are out there, that are drum fed, that has the ability to hold as many as 100 rounds, or even the bell fed. Yes, we are seeing those things coming into our territory. Already this year, more than 300 firearms have been taken off the streets of the Bahamas. Janae Noel Ferguson. Zedness Network News.